in this problem, we're being asked to find um, the tangent of theta in this diagram. And we have numbers for two of the sides in this right triangle. Uh, we don't have um, the degree uh, angle for, for theta here. So how can we figure out this problem? Well, because this is a right triangle, we can apply the Pythagorean theorem, and then we can just use our trigonometric ratios. Remember, so katoa, uh, tangent, is the opposite over the adjacent. So in this case, the tangent of theta is going to be the opposite side of theta, which is this side here that we don't know. I'm just going to call that x. So that's going to be x over the adjacent side, which is 7. So all we need to do is use the Pythagorean theorem to find this side. And let's see, 25 is the hypotenuse. The Pythagorean theorem says a squared plus b squared equals the hypotenuse c squared. So we can put in 7 squared plus x squared equals 25 squared. All right, so 7 squared is 49 plus x squared. And let's see, 25 squared is 625. We can subtract 49 from both sides to get that x squared term alone. And I think that gives us, let me put it over here, x squared equals 576. Ah, yeah. OK. And then we take the square root of both sides, and we get x equals 24. So nice round number there. So x is 24. So the tangent of theta is 24 sevenths. And that's all we have to do with that. So that's how to use the Pythagorean theorem to find a trigonometric ratio.